Hi everybody, welcome back to Star's Kitchen. And of course, I could not do a shot with me Sunday this week because the coronavirus is still affecting us all. So I decided to do another lunch prep video for you guys. I'm gonna show you what I'll be eating for this week at work during lunch with what I already have in my freezer, refrigerator, etc. So to start things off, I'm gonna show you the ingredients that I'm gonna use and then we can move on from there. All right guys, so today we're gonna do fish. This is probably tilapia. I know a lot of people don't like it, but I don't mind it at all. This is actually a turkey link. Um, it's skinless. I love the skinless turkey links. It, sound, it tastes so good. And we have the Uncle Ben's ready rice because I still haven't gotten the regular rice because there's none in the store. And we have some broccoli florets. I will be using some extra virgin olive oil, salt, of course, my favorite pepper, some Creole seasoning, uh, some garlic, some red pepper, and some parsley. That's the bowl that the fish is gonna go in. And of course, I will be using a lemon because I don't have lemon pepper seasoning for some reason. These are the pans and pots that I will be using and there's some of my utensils back there. Okay, so as you guys know, I gotta clean all this stuff off before we get started. And I'm also going to chop up the sausage because I'm actually going to cook the broccoli and the turkey sausage together. It makes it a lot faster. So I'll see you guys in a few minutes after I've got all that prepped. Hi guys, welcome back. So I now can show you where we are and what I have done so far. I have preheated the oven, it's about 375. It doesn't take that long for fish to cook. So I can kind of do things simultaneously. I can cook the broccoli and the turkey sausage while the fish is going, cause it doesn't take that long. Okay, so this is what we have. I have chopped up the sausage. I also chopped up the lemon because I'm gonna place it on my nicely seasoned fish that's right there. And this is what I have left. So of course, you know, the rice only takes 90 seconds. I'm going to place the fish over there and the broccoli and the sausages in here. And you could just sit over there and I'm just going to prop y'all up right here so you can kind of see what I'm doing without me tearing up my camera. All right, here we go. So first, we're going to start with placing the fish in here. Put a little olive oil in the pan, just a little bit. I like to push it around with my fingers because it's just easier. All right. So I think my I think I probably need to upgrade this pan because I can only ever fit like it's probably too small, but we we just gonna pray about it and keep it moving. Right now, I'm just placing my lemon on there. So I placed, I placed my lemon on the fish, but I have half a lemon left, so I'm just gonna, you know, put some extra pizzazz in there. I don't know what it is with me and that little bitter taste, but I love it. So I'm gonna pop this baby in the oven. You can cover it, but I'm just gonna put it in there as is. It will not take very long to cook. Gotta wash my hands real quick. Give me a second. And of course, I'm a clean as you go type person, so I'm just gonna place all this in the sink and try to get it washed as I go. All right, now we're gonna start with the sausage and the broccoli. I like to put it all in there at one time, but you can do it how you want. You can do the sausage, and then you can do the broccoli and then mix it all in there. I'm cooking it all at the same time because these are quick meals for me. They're not supposed to take forever. So I put some olive oil in my pan, I'm gonna turn the eye on. So I'm going to cook this on a medium heat, a little lower than medium, so that the broccoli can steam and soften up just a little bit. Put my sausage in there. Throw all my broccoli in there. 
you can cook it faster if you want but I'm trying to balance it with the time it's going to take my fish to cook so notice I didn't add any seasoning I just kind of put it all in there and then I salt and pepper I'll show you in a second so I'm going to give it a good mix just a little bit before I start just throwing stuff in there all right so I like a little spice too so I'm going to start with my crush with my crushed red pepper. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you see that? Probably not that focused. There we go. So I just sprinkle it all around. All right, I'm gonna put that and my regular pepper up because I don't need it anymore. I forgot about the garlic salt, so I'm going to use just a little bit of garlic salt. Is it focusing? Mm, can y'all see that? Uh, it's not focusing. There we go. Garlic salt. Just a little bit. Honestly and truthfully, the turkey sausage has enough flavor to amp up that broccoli, but you can add as much or if any seasoning that you need. I also like to hit it with just a little bit of salt. Just a little bit, not too much. Put that away. Get my dishes away. Give it another little toss. So you can kind of see what's going on in there. Just a little bit. So this is what it looks like and I'm going to just place the top over it so that it can steam and do its thing. And so let me flip my camera. So I'm just going to let these two things cook. The fish is in the oven, the broccoli and sausage is on the stove. I will wait uh, closer to the time as all of this is almost done for me to put the rice in the microwave and then I will come back to you guys and then you can see me put it all together. All right, see you in a second. All right, y'all, I'm back and I'm taking the fish out of the oven. Everything is done. I'm gonna show you one of the meals and then I'm gonna let y'all go do y'all's thing so I can prep my other stuff. I meant just the rest of the, the meals, but I will show you one. All right, so let me show you what we have. So there's the fish back there, and this is what the broccoli and such looks like. Broccoli and sausage, I guess I should say. I got my rice, I already steamed that, and that's just a little, my snack. Um, I be having a sweet tooth. I just, after I eat, I just, sometimes I need a little bit of sugar. So that's gonna be my snack. And along, of course, with some apple, something, some kind of fruit. But yeah, so let me go ahead and prepare it. I always put my rice down first, my little 90 minute rice. Put the rice. Sometimes I'm all, I put it like all to one side and make it all nice, but sometimes I don't. Sometimes I don't. So then I just scoop up a piece of fish. We'll put the fish in the middle so it can look pretty for y'all. You know what I'm saying? And then I'll take a scoop so I can. This is a probably, this is a meal for a five day work week, just in case. If not, y'all know I don't believe in wasted food. So I'll eat it on Saturday or Sunday or something. So when all is said and done, this is what my actual prep meal is going to look like. Uh oh, let it focus. All right, there it is. It looks good. It actually smells pretty good too, you know, not to toot my own horn. But yeah, so I try to keep it pretty balanced. I throw in some fruit, some vegetables, a starch, and some kind of meat. But if you're vegetarian or whatever, feel free just take the meat out of there or put some uh, some of that um, tofu or the meatless meat 
and you can try it that way but that's all i have for you guys today thank you for coming sorry i hope that i'm able to do shot with me sunday soon but until then please keep liking subscribing commenting and sharing my videos i really do appreciate you guys happy sunday